All right, guys, here we go on the snap-on truck again. Let's see if we'll fucking warranty these. What's going on, Don? Lost my shit. With the flex head. Yeah. I know what you mean. <laughs> you recording me? A little bit. The videos on this truck, it amazes me how many people want to see this crap. Well, as long as all people don't see it. <laughs> Holy crap, this thing's fucking way long. Badass, huh? Yeah. This is even longer than the other one that came out. Should be the same. This was the other one right here. But you didn't have this, you had this. Oh, I have this one. No, I bought that other one where it was just the regular right. the regular handle, but this is like slightly longer than it. Better. Should be able to warranty this. Yeah. yeah. I had to put a cheater pipe on it. That was the only thing I had that could fit to remove a valve and not let go. Sweet. Never. This usually wears out first. Yeah. Out of valve, and that was only like about that much room of space. Oh really? And that was the only thing I can use to to fit in there and crack it free. You should be able to run my cart now. Let me try. Yeah, they changed banks, and then when I deposited that check right now, only like 200 bucks of it's available. I'm like, what the fuck? That's annoying. Is good? Does Snap-on sell the magnets that you guys use on your truck? Yeah. They do? Because uh -huh. I've got those cheaper Harbor Freight ones, but these way fucking better. Yeah. Gauge sanded. How big yeah, is it? Give me like this. No, no, it's not that big. It's like one step above 12 gauge stranded. It's just one step above that. It's mainly used for um. Because the other ones, but they'll get you through this lock too. Yeah. A little bit of lock I sold quite a few of these. I haven't warranted any, so that's a good sign. Yeah. And we make them so they're better. They're not made by a vendor. We make them in-house here. Sweet. I'm going to 
price. Yeah. That's good for me. Want to try those? Yeah. Got it. I need one of these. Fucking inch and a half. Impact. How much is this inch and a half impact one? Yeah. You got it, buddy. Yeah, because I only have a chrome one. Do you got um, impact rated locking extensions in a 3H drive? Yeah, they make a set of them. Do you have any on your truck? No. Baby wrenches are so cute. Sorry. Little baby wrenches. Oh, they work good. SAE. Yeah, everybody already left the shop. I'm already off. Veterans Day. Just a handle. kind of looking around all right Don I'll cut you loose all right man I appreciate your time there brother. it is guys there's today's tool purchases finally bought uh, or I bought this a while ago but finally got it the uh, the quarter inch drive ratchet really long one with the soft grip handle been waiting for that got these um these snap-on wire cutters what I like is that um these have the insulators on the bottom they're pretty comfortable handles 
a half a one and a half inch impact socket with a uh, half inch drive. Needed one of these for a while for a couple different applications. Always used a, uh, a chrome one, but uh, I just fucking hate putting chrome on my impact gun sometimes. It just damages it and it doesn't have the same um, effect as an impact socket. And then you saw he warrantied these, which was really awesome. I, uh, I mishandled the tool and was straight up honest about it and told them what happened and uh, still warranties it. And uh, that's, that's primarily what I pay for. Um, you know, he understands. Don used to work on uh, on aviation equipment, airplanes and such. And uh, he was a mechanic and he used tools himself and he's turned a lot of those wrenches and stuff. And he knows us as technicians will do, some, will do what we have to sometimes to get by. And he's understanding of that and so he warranted it. Um, what you didn't see me buy, I bought it off camera, was um, some snap-on extensions. They were impact rated and they are locking and I bought a six inch and a three inch. And I never knew someone actually made a locking impact extension. Uh, if you want, I don't know if any of you guys see my, my MC Vito Pro Pack bag. I mentioned that nobody makes one. Well, I guess I was wrong. And I'm glad I was wrong. But uh, yeah, that's today's tool purchase and the video. Let me know what you guys think. Comment, like, subscribe. Tune in Friday. There will be another tool giveaway.